Only on five, cats being dumped on the streets of Cleveland. One neighborhood seeing a rise in domestic cats left to starve on the streets. Rescuers believe they all used to be people's pets. News 5's Megan Hickey spoke with neighbors who say this is a growing problem this winter. This little kitten is Nick, named after St. Nicholas because he was found in a Cleveland City trash can just a few days before Christmas on this South Collinwood street. He was drastically underweight. Obviously, it was an expense that I really couldn't afford, but on the other hand, I couldn't sit there and do nothing. Christine Clay says Nick is part of a group of at least nine cats that have shown up on her street in recent weeks. Well-groomed indoor cats that were left on the street to fend for themselves. It's like somebody had just taken them on the street, opened the door to their car, and shoved them out. The Cleveland Animal Protective League tells me they're aware of the cat dumping problem. It's illegal, but there are rarely witnesses, so prosecution is very rare. Brian Licht, director of the Euclid Beach Cat Project, tells me he often sees pets being turned loose. They're dependent on people for food and shelter, and then all of a sudden they're on the streets, and, and they, they don't know how to... How, you know how to fend for themselves. And he said the problem's especially bad when they're declawed. And they said they absolutely, they, they, they have no way to defend themselves. Rescuers like Clay and Licht are hopeful that owners will do their part to curb the growing population of strays. To just abandon a pet that they can't care for itself just makes the problem worse. That was Megan Hickey reporting. The APL says anybody who witnesses animal dumping should reach out to the Human Investigations Hotline. You can head to the News 5 app for more information.